Armenian art includes different branches of art born to satisfy human needs, feelings, and other interests. In the area of the Armenian highlands, archaeologists have also unearthed objects made of stone, glass, gems, and precious stones. They were made to serve domestic and worship purposes. They are of great value to fine arts. Some examples are the stone vases from 6th to 1st centuries BC, which were uncovered from Armavir, Artashat, Hatsavan, and the area of Yerevan. Although these vases are of domestic use, they are of high artistic value. A semi-spherical cup of pale green stone was discovered in the village of Geratir, nearby Yerevan. A similar object was found in Artsakh as well. Polychromatic vessels of Armenia have very interesting appearances. Galyptics was also widely spread in Armenia. Using different gemstones, the masters have made seals, rings, and other highly artistic decorative objects. Different pictures have been portrayed on the gemstones, like elements of worship, epics, livelihood, animal, as well as human portraits. Galyptic examples of work of art from the Arara Kingdom have been uncovered from the region of Old Armavir. The engravings are pictures of lion and leopard. Another glyptic work discovered in the tombs of Oshakam portray the struggle of an archer with a bear. This is an interesting example of old Armenian art of engraving, which is made of yellow garnet. Today, this garnet is displayed at the Paris National Library. Rings of 1st century AD were discovered in the fortress of Garni. The masters have portrayed pictures of bee, fly, a running man with the head of leopard and others. Fine art metallurgy has also progressed in Armenia, which was widely used in different branches of art. Many objects have been found representing different time periods. The thousands of bronze, iron, silver, and gold objects enable us to form an idea not only about the art of metallurgy but about the deities, ceremonies, and livelihood of the people from different time periods. Most notable are the metal objects of 9 to 6 centuries BC, when the art of metallurgy had reached very high standards in the Armenian highlands. Weapons and armor form a major part of artifacts of this period. There are the bronze helmets discovered from the Red Hill region. The inscription on the helmet suggests that one of the helmets belonged to the Argishti I and the second to Sartur II. These helmets are kept in the Museum of History of Armenia. The bronze armor found in the Red Hill area bears the inscription of Argishti I. The horned cups have a very unique place among the metal objects. These cups were used for worship rituals. Similar objects have been found in different areas of historical Armenia and at the base of the citadel of Erebunin. An example of this kind of cup uncovered from Yerzinka is kept at the British Museum. The bottom of the cup presents a lion with the beak of an eagle. It has hands of lion and engravings of wings of eagle and goat horns. This is a typical example of old Armenian art. The horned cups discovered in the historical Armenia are displayed in the Louvre Museum. Their inner part contains an engraving of deer-like animal and the outer part an engraving which appears to be a mouflon. The horned cups of Erebuni are unique since they used to have a rider and a horse at the base. The silver-winged chamois objects from the 6th to the 4th centuries BC discovered in historical Armenia are very interesting. They were of worship and ceremonial significance. The Armenian gold and silver decorative objects are works of high standard of fine arts. This gold decorative object found from Armavir belongs to the 6th or 5th centuries BC. Archaeologists have unearthed gold bangles with the head of snakes from the surrounding areas of Erebuni and Herazdan, belonging to the 6th century. 
Of artistic interest are the coins minted by the Armenian kings in the 3rd to the 1st centuries. The oldest coin discovered was minted by the king Asham of Tzok, historical Armenia, in 240 to 210 BC. On the one side of the coin there is a portrait of the king, and on the other there is a rider or the goddess of victory Niki. The coin has both Armenian and Hellenistic characteristics. During the reign of Tigran the Great, the coins became more accomplished artistically. For example, the coin shown has very high artistic value. Here, the facial features of Tigran the Great are portrayed as well as his inner world. The oldest glass specimen of Armenia is from the 2nd to the 1st centuries. Glassware of artistic design has been discovered from the area of Armavir and Artashad. The ones with high artistic value are made of cobalt, glass of different colors like turquoise, chestnut, and others. When the technique of blowing was discovered in 1st century AD, the glass vessels became more refined, that is, they became more colorful and delicate. Many such specimens have been uncovered from the fortress of Garni, Vagashapat, Artashat, Davin, and tombs of other regions. An interesting specimen of polychromatic glass was found in the tomb of Lichk village at Sevan. This vessel discovered in the region of Garni has decorations which were carved by a wheel. These examples represent the many branches of art of the above-mentioned time period its uses and the